Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Curing Electromagnetic Hypersensitivity. And we're here to review this Schumann resonance experiment. And this experiment is based around the CD. So this was a CD that I developed when I was researching the effects of Schumann resonances and harmonics of the fundamental Schumann resonance frequency on the human brain. And this also applies to headphones. So what's going on with these plants is both plants have a set of headphones and one set of headphones is not connected to anything. So there's no MP3 player on the control. And the experiment plant is actually connected to an MP3 player. And the experimental plant listens to that CD once per day. So we're going to take a little look at what's going on. So this is the control for this experiment. And it's looking very, very healthy. If I put my hand in, you can see that we have the nice large pattern leaves that it's supposed to have. So the control plant looks good. And this is the one with the MP3 player. And if we take a look at this, we actually find that this one is also looking good. So you see we've got the nice large pattern leaves of the Dicobacchia. And this one is a little bit larger than the control plant. So that's what I'm noticing with this experiment. But there's not a huge difference. And if we take a little look at the headphones, you'll see that it, the headphones are actually very small airplane headphones that they give out when you're flying. So they're not that large. So the next step in this experiment is to change out those small headphones into a much larger set of DJ headphones. So I purchased two identical sets of DJ headphones and we're going to put these on the plants and we're going to repeat the experiment. And when I have more information, I will do another video. I hope you enjoyed this video and I wish you the very best of health. Thank you.